Girona. Yeah, I was there in the stadium on Cruyff. I think the team, uh, we're playing a new system, obviously, 4-2-3-1, with a bit different, Messi moving, Coutinho back, Griezmann there. Uh, we're playing differently, but the team needs to needs time to gel. And But I think yeah. I think we're doing positive positive change. Is there anything you're expecting from today's game, like a lot of goals? Yeah, I expect... La Liga against Villarreal, that will be next Sunday. That's been confirmed today, by the way. We're facing Nine the first division team, but they're newly promoted. And uh, Bruno, that in, was quite uh, both of those uh, rounds for promotion. But Elche, nevertheless, just, well, they were impossible to beat. Impossible to... And Elche Robert is back in La Liga for the first time since 2015. And apart from this team is Huesca and Cadiz. Those three newly promoted teams, and but Ansu Fati gets his first start, and, and who can offer plenty of things here as uh, Barca make a move forward. We'll talk about Pjanic in a minute. Here is Ansu Fati combining with Felipe Coutinho. What a preseason Coutinho has had as well. The young on the right, Busquets on the left. Yeah, the doubt will be, of course, uh, which two players will form this. This uh, you also have Alenia. So exactly. I think all these games uh, are going to be really useful to come. So it looks like we're playing with those. Two traditional midfielders. It's quite impressive in these oh, first two games. this precision after the penalty he scored against Nasty. Here is Ansu going one on one and tripped over. Also, will have a chance to cross the ball in from the left hand side. So was tripped by Yosan there. Wouldn't we all like to have the ability to shoot with our right foot like Lionel Messi did? And they're in the stand. De Jong. Finds Ansu Fati on the left, Ansu back to by, uh, Clement Langley and Barca. Move forward through Ansu Fati who waits for support. Here is Ansu. Pedri as well. Yeah, exactly, so it's going to be a big fight there. There's a beautiful combination there between Alba and Coutinho. Ansu Fati From tried to. Knee surgery, so during the first few weeks we'll see Neto start. Fatty receives the ball on the left. He has two players in front of him. Decides to go back. Barca one, and, and in which, of course, Ronald Krumen was the hero. Here's Ansu Fatty making run forward. Ansu tries to get inside the box. I don't think he could quite decide whether to go right or left. So yeah, he just... I, I, obviously, I meant uh, for Barca player and Barca exactly. coach. Here is uh, Ansu Fatty. Barca on the move. Alba, Ansu. Barca have moved things up a gear now, it seems. Ansu trying to go one on one. Griezmann finding Ansu Fati on the left. Ansu pass inside to De Jong. Back to Griezmann. The shot. Should switch it over to the left where Barca have more space. Here is Ansu Fati. He's got Frankie De Jong to his left. Ansu drives into the middle. The combination with uh, Messi. No Griezmann. All the way to the right. But Barca did a good defensive recovery there. Here is Messi trying to feed Ansu. It's no doubt a special one. Here is Sergio Roberto making a run forward. Here is Roberto with a cross. Great cross inside. Ansu Fati brings it down on his chest. That just had just too much power on it. And Ansu couldn't keep control of the ball. A minute and a half left in this first half. We'll see if Barca managed to score another goal. We're back for the second half of this 55th edition of the Juan Gamper Trophy. It's Barca won. Elche nil at half time. The goal by Antoine Griezmann giving Barca the win. Moving the ball around. Here is Ansu Fati. He's been quite active in the first half. We'll see how long he plays. Coming back off of that uh, injury, one of the players we guess will probably not complete the full game. So for, for me, it has been a surprise to, to see Ansu in the static lineup. Uh, had his opportunity, so did Felipe Coutinho. Here is uh, Sergio Roberto with a cross to the header by Ansu, goes wide. What a great chance there for Ansu Fati. Once again, the danger coming from the right flank with those forward runs by Sergio Roberto. He's been very active today. Elche defense clears it away, but Barca win it back. Dispossessed in the end. Barca keeping up the pressure. Again, moving up a gear in pace. Here is Lionel Messi after a great find by Ansu Fati. And Messi is denied by Edgar Varilla. Now Messi, after being found by Frankie de Jong, Ansu Fati, Ansu dribbles inside, manages to get free, and he oh, but keeps control. Messi, who had a defender on top of him, so he was probably fouled, but the referee. 
Top also on the left here is Ansu Fati. Now Messi from a standstill point finds Ansu on the left. Here is Ansu trying to drive forward. Ansu could take uh, advantage of a couple of ricochets. Oh. Here is Ansu. Ansu gets the ball. Oh, it's a handball. And, and if there was no penalty. handball, that would have penalty. definitely been a penalty. But in the clash with uh, Badia, or in the fight for the ball with Badia, there, the ball went up in the air and it hit the arm of Ansu. And that was what was called. We'll see it again. Ansu chasing for the ball, and as Badia tried to clear, he had his arm stretched out and well, took <laughs> Coutinho inside to Ansu. Can he find the opening? The shot by Ansu over the crossbar. And it looked like there was no space, but Ansu managed to create it. A little shimmy, a flick to his right. And that was enough space created to shoot. We'll see it again here. He's just 17 years old. This is Pass forward to Ansu Fati. He'll fight with uh, Hossan. Awesome. Changing things, but yeah, last minute score. Fans to vote for the MVP oh, yes, on the course. Barca's official website. And this guy could be the MVP. Ansu Fati Ooh. creating his own opportunity. A couple of dribbles, the shot across goal, and it just went wide. I'd say he's the MVP of the second half so far. Ansu Fati, relentless in creating opportunities. Every time that Ansu gets the ball, it's, it's just. It's, you don't know what to expect. It's brilliant <laughs> to, to see him playing football. It's just amazing. Same thing. Here is uh, Alba winning the ball back. Ansu in the middle. Ansu again. Now trying to connect with Messi. Back to De Jong. Ansu Fati. A Liga title and a Champions League title this season. Who knows? <laughs> Here is uh, Ansu Fati inside the box. Ansu trying to get away from Danny Casa. I think actually play very deep in their own half. Here's Ansu. Ansu. In the end. Fouled uh, for Sun there. It's the, the best out of the situation. There'll be a corner kick, I believe. In the background there, that's Ansu Fati leaving the um, 